Welcome back. We'll start off with a close up shot. Center of the tank. The red zoas. Satosa coral. Soaking up all of the LED light from the Kessel A360 WEs. Five of them is definitely overkill. Um, but hopefully I'll be upgrading and then it'll be just right. So more Zoas. One of my favorite um, parts of the tank is that section of the Zoas where all the colors just kind of mingle together. I start off the day um, salinity 34.7, um, temperature 26.4. Celsius pH was at 8.18. That's before the lights come on at 1245. Uh, and then I tested the DKH at 9.2. Uh, by the end of the day, uh, salinity has shifted just a little bit, not too much, at 34.6 PPT. Temperature uh, goes up a little bit because the lights have been on. Uh, I don't think the algae reactor is adding too much heat. Um, to the system the Tunzi lights are pretty low watt and then the pump for it is low watt uh, so the temperature towards uh, the end of the photo period was 26.7 celsius and let's see i dosed it a whole bunch of acupower so the skimmer cup pretty much has filled up slightly more than halfway um, it holds about half gallon so that's that. I'll be changing that soon. Also picked up, uh, or actually collected, a couple of Kamor pumps. Uh, so I've been reading reviews. I'm definitely not an early adopter in a lot of things um, in life. I like to sit back, see other folks's, um, I don't know, their input on how the pumps are. So... I'm leaning towards the Wi-Fi because of the CoreView uh, controller that's coming up. Nice shot of the algae reactor. So we'll see with that. Also picked up a clear piece of acrylic. I'm trying to raise the water level in the first chamber of the Trigger Crystal Series sump. So we'll see how that works out. Uh, up close shot of the... Uh, sea monkeys and, and so yeah I just you know been dosing that um, completely um, alternating usually one or two sometimes I've been overdoing it but it's fun watching the fish uh, chase it so that's the update for today thanks for watching